a proud lion sitting in the forest, decided to go for a hunt. While roaming stealthily, he spotted a flock of goats. As he pounced to grab one, all the goats scattered, leaving only the mother goat to get caught. But just as the lion was about to eat her, she began to laugh loudly. The lion was stunned. He asked the goat, Why are you laughing when I'm about to eat you? The goat replied, I pray that all my children become sterile so that no more goats may be born to suffer the way I'm going to suffer. I've hurt no one in my life. I spend my day only eating wild plants and grass, and yet I'm about to be skinned and eaten. I laugh when I think about your fate. What will happen to someone like you who grabs the throat of others and devours their flesh? The lion understood what the goat was saying. When was the last time you killed someone? Killed someone's spirit with your words, your actions, with what you chose to do for them or not to do? Every day we make choices in how we interact with others. We make choices to see some people as friends and others as enemies. To some we show kindness, love, compassion, and we go out of our way to make them happy. But then there are others to whom we are rude and unkind. We show arrogance and pride because we think we're better than them. We all have a choice at every moment to act like the proud lion, to be vicious, brutal and self-absorbed. Or we can be kind, thoughtful, considerate like the humble goat. Humility is not a characteristic that many people aspire to have. We are taught by society that to succeed in life is to put yourself first. We're taught to make the best of our skills and abilities. Yet, have you ever wondered where these abilities came from? If you're intelligent, if you're strong, if you're resourceful, if you're important, if you're powerful, then how did you become that way? Are you really the one who can be proud of these abilities? Or did the universe help you to become what you are today? Don't be so proud of your strength and power that you forget to be kind to others. We are all made with our own unique strengths and abilities. It is only when we learn to put other people first that we find a sense of inner peace and lasting fulfillment. The goat's final message to the lion was that at the end of the day, we are all on this earth for a short while. But when we're both dead, whose actions will be remembered and respected? The deeds of the arrogant or the actions of the kind?